Hey guys, and welcome back today to the Brighton Career Mode. Last time out, we had a pretty indifferent preseason tournament in the uh, International Champions Cup. I think of that, or is it uh, European International Cup? Sorry, I keep getting those wrong. Um, we won one, drew one, lost one. We started with a 0 0 draw, picked up a solid uh, win in the second game, and then, oh sorry, the second, a bit of a loss in the second game, and then a solid win in the third. Uh, we played alright. Well, we're still improving, we're still in the transfer market, we can still possibly sign a couple of players, but hopefully in this episode we're going to start the actual season off, we're going to try and pick up some points, put them on the board and get ourselves into a good position early on. Uh, and hopefully, oh, we've just got another transfer offer accepted here for um, a youngster. Okay, so after a little bit of debate and a couple of, we had to go back and forth, my fault on that one. Uh, Rico Henry has accepted his contract, so we're going to go ahead and bring him to the club. Welcome aboard, sir. Alright, so it's time for the first game of the season against Derby County. Now, I did say at the start of the last episode, I think at the start of the last episode, um, I'm pretty much going to do playing some games, at least two an episode, which we're going to do this one, and I'm going to also do some simulation games throughout, because if we have to play every game in this series, it's going to be 46 league games minimum. Uh, plus any cup games in the League Cup, FA Cup, free plays we have in that as well and like That would just take forever and I don't want everyone sort of just sitting here for like Three years watching it pretty much Or make, have to suffer them through watching that so we're gonna play the first one and we're gonna sim a couple Maybe play another one if it's a big game and then uh, simulate another one Maybe two would depend see what the time is and uh, Yeah, we'll try and do that for a few episodes and if people don't like me simulating I can play offline and then just show highlights and we'll see, but let's go ahead and jump into the first game of the season against Derby County. Uh, we're at home, which is a good start. And uh, so yeah, that's the team I've gone with. The beast that is ruining. Oh, slips man him in behind. Just pull in. Oh, I just pull behind everyone. Um, oh my god. Oh, we got a little lucky there. We got a little lucky for Sartori. Penalty ref, penalty. Come on! And there it is, half time. Uh, nil nil. Not much has happened at either end. There's been no real clear cut chances. There's been some half chances for both teams. Hopefully, this second half will, however, produce some goals. Hopefully, they're for us, not for Derby. more. Oh, there's more. Ah! Oh. That was when I thought the opportunity was going to come. Mm, Darby just hit the post. I'm not sure how he just muscled past every player and no one made an actual tackle, but Jesus Christ, that was a walking shot. Um, and they did hit the post, so... Oh? Oh, Kyle! Okay, so we're going to make a couple of changes here just because I feel things aren't working. We're going to bring on Endres Pereira, who we signed for Manchester United at the end of the episode, last episode. Sorry, bleh. I bring on Darren Bent. And we'll also give Hemed his first go off top. I would like to bring on James Wilson. I just thought Hemed might be a better option in this situation because he's the, uh, technically a better striker. Back in the wall. Back in the bong. Now Kyle. He's ruining Forward now, Hemet. Got the fun for it. Oh! My god, Perea! That was so close! Good feet from Perea. Not a great finish, but it nearly deflects off the keeper and still goes in. But credit for the save. So we start this episode exactly the same way we started the last episode with a very disappointing 0 0 draw. We had chances to win it, we had a couple of really good opportunities, Pereira had a great chance, Kyle had a really great chance, but in the end, none of the teams can find the back of the net, and it's ended in a goalless draw. I mean, okay, it's a clean sheet, okay, it's a point, it's not a defeat opening day, which is a good thing, but... I mean, look at those stats, the entire game, five shots, the entire game, all on target, which is pretty decent, and good pass accuracy, but... It was a boring game where nothing happened, so 
Oh, we, there's much improvement we need to make in this season. Look through my own things here on my like store. I've got a financial takeover. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to do that. Not so much so that we have just huge money so we can buy whoever the hell we want. I'm not going to go stupid. I'll buy players of the level of Brighton. But it would just give us more financial security and hopefully allow us to do a few more contracts and sign a few more players and just give us more money in the bank for the future, like uh, transfers and stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to redeem that. All right. So basically, as I said, we're going to sim the games. Our next game off is the Capital One Cup against Sheffield Wednesday. They want us to reach around a 32, but I'm not too worried about cup competitions. My effective, my effective, my objective is the league. As you can see, we've made several changes to the team. Uh, so we'll go ahead and sim this one. Hopefully, we can pick up a win here and get our first win of this career. Come on, boys. Oh no, Matthias has scored. The one nil down. Who am I in the book? Oh Matthias has scored a second one. Oh wow, this is uh Ooh. Hey James Wilson has pulled one back for us. But it was nothing more than a consolation. We have absolutely just been battered off the park here again not what I was hoping for in the situation not how I thought that would happen but Capital One Cup is now over for us so we don't have to worry about the FA Cup till I think January so we can focus on the league okay back to league action now uh, it's gonna be another sim game and it's against the MK Dons we're home again we haven't actually been away yet we've been home in the league twice now and we've been home in the cup so Mixed form at home. Hopefully, this one can be a second win, or second win, a first win of the season. But like, um, hopefully, we can actually win. For a little while, a while. Yes, six minutes played, one nil. There we go. This is a better start. Rico Henry sent off for his uh, league debut. Thirty-one minutes in. I just also realised Forster Kasky is playing for the MK Dons. What James Wilson with his second goal? Nice. Before Sakaski is our player on loan. First win of the season though. 2 0 at home to the MK Dons. Get in there. James Wilson, Kazenga Luwalawa with the goals. Enrico Henry, gonna get a bit of a slapping. Not so good for him. Alright, okay, so game four episode. We're actually gonna play this one because it's against Charlton. It's a big team. Uh, they're currently 7th, we're in 3rd, level 1 points, so this should be quite a good like, clash, we're away from home, our first away game of the season. We won last time out against the MK Dons, but so far with me playing we haven't scored a goal. We've had good possession to a degree, we've had good control of the ball, we've passed it well, we've had good shooting accuracy, we just have not yet really found the net with me, so good play by Manu, he's on the run. Spot was on the far side, but can't pick him out. On the come forward, gets the ball. And Perea steps in. Boom! 1 0. Andreas Perea. He's not that great a player in this game, but he's just so good. He's just such a good little player. If you do want to sign a cheap young player that has potential to go on to be really decent, sign Andreas Perea. 1.1 million completely and utterly worth it I mean just look at it here he knows where he's running good header by Bong good control cuts back inside and just lashes it top corner 1-0 come on and uh, no, a really pressing what a save Stockdale Jesus Christ I thought it was going to be 1-1 for a second there I mean that was a good strike it's going in oh nice work Oop, good punch. <sighs> just like that, it's 1-1. One, one. I... Oh, he, he just tore us down the right hand side. I could not stop him at all. Just look at this, he comes in. Goes past one, 
two, three, and pass it across. It hits the inside of the post. Goalkeeper's never going to reach that one in the top corner. 1-1. One, one. Game on. Zamora, he's been a bit useless so far. Come on. Good ball into the wall. Come back inside. Go fast. Play the ball across. Oh, Zamora! Pereira! No! Oh! Had a Oh! That was our best chance so far. Getting a second goal, sort of thing. And it's half time. Oh, if Zamora just put it to a corner, it was 2 1 before half time. But we're playing well. Hopefully, the second half can be an improvement. God, that was a good near you know, post header, and it's another draw. It's a score draw this time, one-one. Uh, we dominated more so the first half, but Charlton just decimated us in the second half. I'm very disappointed. So, final game of the episode. Uh, we're going to be home to Wolves. Another sim game. Uh, we've not done so well today. We've lost in the cup, drawn two in the league, and uh, no, we lost in the cup. Sorry, yeah, lost in the cup, drawn two in the league, and one-one in the league. Hopefully, oh, Kyle, yes. As I was saying that. Hopefully we can make two wins, two draws, and a loss in this episode. Come on, boys, come on. So tour. Henry's come on for them. Ward's come on for us. Oh, Benekophobi. Ah, oh, it's another draw. Three draws, a win, and a loss this episode. It's not been ideal. Um, so yeah, that's the end of this episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this. Um, if you do, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Uh, and I'll see you guys in episode three, where hopefully we'll actually be able to win a couple games and hopefully improve the team's fortunes. But until then, I'll see you.